Yo, what's up, guys? Robot IQ here doing a desk tour, I guess. Um, told you I'd do this yesterday. Didn't get around to it. I did get a video up yesterday. Um, I'll show you guys what I was doing yesterday. So I got these hung up, and then I did off camera the remote to what I will show you guys later. So this remote goes to something pretty cool. Uh, I've had it for a while. Um, turn it off there. Um, actually, I've had it for a very long time, but I've had it for this use for maybe about two months now. I just haven't had to sit up. It's been sitting over here on the floor next to the side of my desk. So, show you guys what that is real quick. It's the same Velcro that is on this. Uh, you have to push it for it to connect. So, pretty cool, guys. Get to the desk. You guys, so doing a quick hand here. There's the remotes and the spatula, or the scrapers. 3D printer using glue and filament. I am actually currently 3D printing something. It is a Beware of Nerd sign, I believe. I will show you guys that in a minute here on this, uh, on something, uh, the computer. And it is going to be glow in the dark. So this will be done about 10 o'clock tonight. Um, I will post a short video. Uh, me installing it at some point. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do the inside of the door or the outside of the door. It doesn't have any holes in it for like push pins, but it ain't that hard to punch through plastic that only has 10% infill. So I'll figure something out for that, guys. Again, going around <laughs> all my messy electronics. Uh, I got a lamp back here. I'm gonna show you guys. So this is a glow in the dark filament. So I don't know if it's gonna glow, but it might because, uh, no, it does not glow. Uh, it's not charged it yet enough yet. I've had this little lamp on here. Um, kind of charges it a little bit, but not too much. I need to get like a light that kind of sits like right here next to the nozzle that uh lights it a little bit better for this stuff. So you know, once it's ready, it glows when I turn off the lights. So that's that, guys. And then if I pan over, there's the laptop. It is a Toshiba satellite, currently running Windows 8.1, I believe. So, here is the, uh, the interface I use. Where's the mouse? For Kira, I use the prompt interface IU. Um, so, yeah, I use that, guys. And then, the crown jewel, like I was talking about, guys. Second monitor. So, this used to actually just be my TV, but, I mean, really, who watches TV anymore? Uh, that's what YouTube's for. Hey guys, that's why I'm here. So, uh, yeah, it's a, a little, uh, Dynex, uh, TV, like, I think, I believe it's like a 19-inch here. Let me get out the tape measure for you guys. No one will believe me if I don't measure. Laptop, 17.1 inch. I believe here I'll measure that, too. No one believes anything these days, you don't prove it to them. So there, guys, right, the laptop. 17. Let's do the TV. Second monitor. Guys, one clip, no cuts in between. What does that say? If it would focus, you guys would know. Nineteen. So yes, it is nineteen inches. Um nineteen point one or something like that. So uh yeah guys. Um I'll show you what I'm 3D printing here on Kura real quick. So yeah, it says beware nerd and then it has like some Barnacles nerdgasm glasses. If you haven't checked out his channel, check it out. Not a sponsor, but I wish. Pretty cool guy. Um, check out his channels in my featured channels if you look on, I believe it's on iOS and PC, or, uh, at least I use iOS, um, and PC, but, um, so yeah, you wear nerd with some glasses, guys, doing, uh, actually, this is wrong, I'm using 0 0.8 here, 0 0.8 shell thickness, but, uh, layer height 0 0.2, shell thickness 0 0.8, Enabling retraction, uh, the speed's 40 millimeters a second at 4.5 millimeters for the retraction. 
Uh, 50% infill with a top and bottom thickness of 0.6 millimeters. Print speed of 50 millimeters a second, as well as the travel speed bottom layer is the is uh 20 millimeters a second. In my infill speed is 80 millimeters a second. Print temperature I have it 210, and my bed's at 70. So I'm actually gonna confirm that for you guys. I can't confirm the uh the print uh printing temperature because I can't get my the thermometer to focus on a small enough area like that. But I have a little uh, infrared thermometer. It's infrared. So, oh, it's on Fahrenheit there. So, I'm going to take you guys off the tripod here and put you next to the LCD. So, it's on the bed, guys. Remember, it's at 70 for the bed temperature, 70C. So, ready? Moment of truth. Does that say 70 degrees C? Guys, just because I'm going to try to get it focused on the nozzle, there is a little laser. So I'm going to see if I can do this. As, as you can see, there is a little fan blowing on it. So it doesn't, it can't get that real good. So, but, yes, it is 70C. Um, I have a little box here. I call this my 3D printing box. Multi-purpose, of course. But, um, oh yeah, calipers, let's get those. Uh, I got these for Christmas, like, two years ago, I think. One year ago, maybe. I have no clue. Um, just general. Uh, calipers, I think, got them at, like, Home Depot. Yeah, I got them up there. Uh, come with an extra cell battery. Haven't needed to use it yet. Come with a screwdriver. Well, little screwdriver for replacing your battery when it dies. So, you just, I believe, or actually, no. Yeah, you have to unscrew this little screw back here. Then you can get your battery cover off. So, um, pretty nice, actually. Uh, a lot of my robotics coaches said they won't, wish they had these ones. But, it does millimeters. Zero off on. So it does millimeters. Uh, you guys. So, millimeters. Inches. And inch fractions. So, I like them a lot, guys. Check them out. Pretty cool. Um, nice case with some foam in it. Let's get back to Vin. Um, so, let's get you off the tripod. So, I just got some spare change in here. Allen keys for the through printer. Some of these, like, moisture absorbents uh, for the filament. A extra filament clip, but I didn't show you guys that. I'll show you the other filaments I got. Uh, SD cards, rubber bands, and a carabiner. Um, some screwdrivers, some pliers, some side cuts. I got an extra thermistor, uh, the fan that was broken, tape measure, pocket knife, um, some zip ties off Amazon. Cable ties, under pack. So. Focus there. So, yeah. Um, guys, that's pretty much it. I mean, there's not much else on the desk. Um, but you got a you know, wide view here. Oh, that's the tripod I bought for Best Buy. Gets pretty tall. Um, I'll show you guys the other filament. So this is the white that came with the printer, with the trial roll. Um, some gold. Oh, here's. Oh, you can't see it because the filament clips are printed in gold. But filament clip there, you guys. Some tape. Some. I got some Ninja Flex. Uh, leave a comment below if there's anything you want to see me print with Ninja Flex. I got lava, which is like a bright orange and a silver color. Um, yeah, I got some my my tapes for the print bed and some epoxy. Guys, yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, there's not much else. Just got a bookshelf. I'm, oh, here's the lens I was using. Some other videos. So I got the lens cap on right now, but 
that's the lens I was using. Got that off Amazon as well. Uh, got this off Amazon. I got a lot of things off Amazon, guys. I don't have a credit card. So, uh, I mean, yeah, I'll post a little bit, a little video when this is done. I'll probably do it tomorrow. Um, see you later, guys.